Billy Graham traveled across the United States and to many countries across the globe during his nearly eight decades of ministry. Over the years, many locations, particularly in the United States, honored Billy with a key to their city, a tangible thank you for visiting their town. One of the largest keys given to Billy was from Seattle, Washington in July 1951 by then Mayor William F. Devon. During this crusade, Billy was approached by a man named Abraham Varide, who had it on his heart to reach political leaders with the gospel through an annual presidential prayer breakfast, now the National Prayer Breakfast. Eisenhower, who was president at the time, was reluctant at first to host a prayer breakfast, but eventually agreed. The National Prayer Breakfast has been a tradition since 1953 and continues to this day. Sometimes, keys to the city are made into other items, such as this key from Knoxville, Tennessee, which was made into a lapel pin. This key was presented to Billy by Mayor Leonard Rogers at his crusade in Neyland Stadium at the University of Tennessee in Knoxville in 1970. Even cities in Billy's home state honor him with keys. The town he lived in most of his life, Montreat, North Carolina, honored him with a key, as did Greensboro, and even his hometown of Charlotte. Billy sometimes received a key to the same city more than once, as is the case with the key to Manchester, New Hampshire. Billy was gifted this brass key to Manchester by Roland S. Valley, then mayor of the city, at his crusade there in 1964. Later, he received this gold key to Manchester from Emil D. Bewley, mayor of the city in 1982. Billy's son, Franklin Graham, followed in his father's footsteps when he visited Manchester in May 2019 with his Decision America tour. Despite the threat of rainy weather that night, many people came to hear the gospel message and accepted Christ as their Lord. The simple gospel message shared by Billy Graham over the years continues today through the evangelistic efforts of Franklin as well as Franklin's son, Will Graham. Thanks for watching. Join us again next time as we feature more items from our vault.